Okay. Um, probably didn't play well enough to win today. Um, you know, we didn't play play well in the first half. We, um, you know, we get a fourth down stop in their own territory. Uh, get end up getting a field goal. We we turn the tight end loose on a on a route. Um, had some over routes that uh, hit on us. We had to change some things up at halftime, but um, you know we didn't start the game well enough to to uh, really play as well as we could. We came back better and played better in the second half. But uh, you know, obviously the the end of game situations. You know, like I told the team, you know, you you played all these close games. They're going to come down to either win or lose, and um, you know that's just that's just the way the NFL is. Well, they're hitting us on some over routes, you know, running the ball, taking the receiver, and running them across the formation, and um, you know, get, getting outside the pocket a little bit. So we had to just change it up. Yeah, I couldn't even. T- no, he he was supposed to be off, but I couldn't tell exactly where the, his in, where inside help was or or not. But I mean, yeah. I just wanted to see what the formation was going to be. How was the team doing after a loss like this? Obviously, it was the Lions' first win of the season. Uh, how was the team doing and what did you kind of say about it? I already told you what I said to them, but they're not doing good. But Like Madison. Excuse me? Uh, Madison was forced into the kind of primary running back role. What do you think of the other day? Um... It's hard for me to say. You know, I, I think there, he had some good runs, and I thought, you know, maybe there were some holes he missed too. What do you think was behind some of the offensive struggles in the first half? I don't know. You know, they, they do a good job mixing up the coverages. They're, they're um, you know, when we played them the first time, we only scored 19 points or something. Um, but, um, you know, we, we had to get on the ball and move, you know, a little bit more tempo in the second half because we were just – we just seemed methodical and lethargic uh, in the first half, I thought. Yeah, well, they, they, they've had some zeros. Uh, you know, the one play that Adam Thielen got hit, hurt on was a zero that we tried to hit a, a wide receiver screen on. Um, but, yeah, they've done that some. How did you feel overall about the two-point reversal plays? Like yeah, they weren't very good, I didn't think. You know, we tried to run it in. Smash it down their throats on the, from the one yard line, and uh, and then we try to hand the ball off to uh, Kane. So those weren't they weren't the best. Yeah, because we gave him three points there. But you know we were, we weren't playing very well. I was trying to get something going. You know the two plays before that we had guys wide open, and so I thought you know maybe. You know, I had confidence in the offense to to hit that. Yeah. Um. We we didn't we weren't covering that great, so um, I mean everything's hindsight, I guess. I don't know. It wasn't. I mean, we got some sacks, but it wasn't. You know, it wasn't like he was under duress that much. Move who? Um. Yeah. Well, no. Well, we we. You know, we thought he he was he's obviously a good rusher, but. Um, no, I mean, not more than we anticipated, really. You know, they did that a lot because Flowers has been out. No, no, I mean, we actually try to keep some more guys in coverage, really. We just change up the fronts, how we're doing it a little bit. What was your thinking on changing up the offensive? I don't know, I'll have to look at the tape, but we just felt like that would be the best option moving forward. Thielen goes out with your passing game today. Excuse me? Thielen goes out with your passing game today. Jefferson had good numbers, and then Osborne seemed to be a nice uh, option on at least one of those drives. What, what did you think generally of those 
Yeah, well, KJ's made a lot of plays throughout the course of the year, and obviously Jefferson's a really good player. So, um, you know, we Conklin has, has been effective for us. So, um, you know, they did what they usually do. Time for two more. Mike, what do you say to the fans who may be weary after the disappointing loss today? Well, we're all disappointed, but we're going to keep fighting. Um, you know, we'll get some guys back next week. I anticipate getting quite a few defensive guys back, and we'll keep fighting. How much pressure is this put on you guys to try to make the last move forward, and then now obviously a short week against the Pittsburgh? Well, obviously, we, our backs are to the wall, but they've been back, back against the wall for a while.